Hey everybody, we're back for some more Crypt of the Necrodancer. So I've been itching to play this game. Uh, I actually played a little bit uh, just a moment ago, tried the daily challenge, and didn't do too great in it. I figured I might as well record it if I'm going to be playing, even though it's a little bit ahead of schedule. But here we go. Uh, so I want to actually start with a hardcore run, because I'm actually doing a little better at that. Um, I changed my calibration just a little bit so it feels better. I understand the enemies a bit better. I actually successfully took down a red dragon. Hardcore mode's still pretty hard. I haven't gotten past uh, zone 1 level 3. So this is basically like the daily challenge would be. After this, um, I think I probably want to explore zone 2 a little bit and figure out what's going on in it. Oh, that was... Okay, right, I forgot the red bat moves once per turn. The blue ones move once every other turn. Titanium dagger, cool! More damage, I'm fine with that. I shouldn't have moved there like I did. The blue bat could have gotten me. But I didn't. Oh yeah, I like this weapon. It would be better if it had more range, but I'm perfectly happy with it as is. So I'm learning that those green and black skeletons, once their uh, heads come off, they'll just run in one direction. I still don't know if this is really a good idea to do. Cause yeah, that one's going to cost me health, and I don't have the health to spend on it. I'm not sure how I could have gotten onto that monkey without... Uh, yeah, don't have the health to spend without losing my coin multiplier somehow, just because of the way he was on a different tile than I was. If you know what I mean? Alright, uh, time to go? Yep, we've explored everything. So I wasted my bomb. Well, not wasted. I know what's through there now. I uh, could buy a pickaxe. Is that a glass whip? I'm gonna wait a little while. I don't feel like I, the pickaxe is really that crucial. Aw, oh, dang it, I did it again. Yeah, I think in situations like that I just need to wait and lose my coin multiplier rather than lose a heart if I don't have a weapon that can reach more than just the tile right in front of me. Crap. So glad those monkeys don't do any damage. I like the Spelunky monkeys, they just get in your way a little bit. Hassle you, but don't actually hurt you. I don't know what the Ring of Luck does. It's so dark. Aw, oh, that was dumb. <laughs> I want to do another hardcore run and do a little better at it. Okay, let's not, uh, let's not take stupid damage right at the start. Yeah, I'll go back to normal mode in just a moment. I just like to make a serious attempt to get through all three levels of Zone 1. I'm not gonna bomb out a rocky wall this time. Seems like there's always a- sorry, a cracked wall. Seems like there's always a cracked wall on the first floor, from what I'm observing. And it's usually that uh, gear for health thing. But occasionally it's something else. We saw the boss arena the one time. Oh. Yeah, so in a situation like that, how could I kill that monkey without losing my coin multiplier? Is it possible? Can I go through here? Yeah. Black chests don't take coins. Cool. Yeah, there's a thing I'm going to ignore this time. I don't want to ignore it. Oops, how do I do that? I would like... I already have some armor, so let's just buy these two things. Alright, since I have an apple, I can heal, so maybe I can actually buy buy something and be at full health, or buy two things here. Uh, I want... Ooh, I've never had a morning star before. Let's try it. Flail, whatever that is. Alright, we'll heal back up. I'm not going to buy anything else. I'd rather keep my health than survive. Oh! Ooh! That looked like a big arc attack. Let's 
see if we can figure out how it works with these guys. So is it like, um... Whoa, it knocks things back! Oh, that's neat! And it looks like it has broadsword-like range. Whoops. Oh, hey. Didn't see you guys before. Oh, hey, it's a big one! Look at that! I saw a skeleton like this before. Okay, okay, okay. So it can attack to the side of me. I was actually, uh, I pressed down there. Um, and it got the, the bat loops to my, to the left. I guess that would be her right. Oh man, that knockback is amazing. So it's like it gets actually five tiles. Let's see what this does. Ow! Hey! That's terrible! Wait, that gave me a blood whip. Maybe that's worthwhile? Let's try it. Okay, I thought that might hurt me, but I had to try it to find out for sure. Mm -hmm. I have gold. Or does that give me more money, maybe? I'll take a fireball spell for sure. We didn't actually use this last time we had it. Next enemy I see, I'm going to use it. Up and right. Uh, not this guy. We know how to handle him. Something a little bit more threatening. I'm sure there's something over here. Somewhere. What did I see? It's a zombie. Black skeleton. That's a good one. Oh, okay. It's horizontal. Oh, I hear a, uh, minotaur or dragon or something. Ah, it's a red dragon. Okay. Let's see if we can do this right. He seems to only, um... Yeah, he can only fire horizontally, so it's like he has this fire spell. Oops, lost my rhythm there. So as long as I'm not in his path when that happens... Actually, if I go vertically, I... Oh, the zombie... Oh, no, no, actually, the dragon got me because I attacked the zombie instead of moving. All right, I almost had him. So if I, if I do it only vertically, I can fight him like a green dragon. All right, anyway, um, let's go back to the lobby and learn a little bit about, uh, Zone 2. How many turns is it for these guys? One, two, three, four. Okay. Ooh, two diamonds! Still don't entirely understand how the armadillos work. I think they're- ooh, he hit me. I think they're like miniature, um, uh, minotaurs. What the hell? What? What was hitting me there? Oh, you! Wait, no. What? That was weird. I don't know what was damaging me there. I, I, I missed something. If there are diamonds in these walls, I don't know how to recognize them. I keep wondering about that. Ow! Ah! Does that wind spell hurt me, or does it just move me? Okay, that must have been what was hurting me before. That thing's spew. Was that wall moving, or did I imagine that? Oops. It's a wall monster. Interesting. Okay. What killed me? Wall moving. Okay. Oh, uh, spend diamonds. Can't afford either of those. Oh, wow, that's getting really expensive. Hello. Uh, chicken leg would be good, I guess. What does Merlin have? Hi. Some sort of ring? Let's try it. Ring of Peace. So it was the Shrine of Peace that gave me an extra heart last time. Maybe the, uh... I actually want to look at this. Um... Oh, what?! I have to pay diamonds to do that?! Man... That's lame. Beastmaster, let me do it free. Ooh. We don't know about any of these. Hmm. So there's bigger bosses than those, huh? Alright, back to zone two. Oh, ow. Hmm, not sure how to deal with that in that case. I guess I gotta force it against a wall, maybe? 
Shrine of Risk. I would like... Oh, I wanted that spear. Alright, well, the Ring of Peace has indeed given me extra heart, so that's good. I'll take the torch, and I'll come back to the leather armor in a minute. I see it. There's a diamond. Okay, now we know what they look like. Ooh, two! So pretty much the same. What is that? Oh, that's the shrine. Looked like an enemy from here. Look at that. It's like those two red glowing things are like its eyes. How do I handle you in that situation? Uh, yes. Broadsword's better than what I had. All I had was a dagger. I'm gonna have to watch the video back to see if that wind spell is damaging me. So I keep forgetting to look at my hearts before I get near a wizard thing. Whatever those are. Hmm. What does the Ring of Charisma do? I'd rather have the Ring of Peace because I know what it does. So if I take the Ring of Charisma, maybe I'll figure it out. Ooh, three buttons. I'm gonna switch. I don't think I'll ever get four more hearts back. So let's see if we can figure out the Ring of Charisma. Only thing I can think is maybe it lowers shop prices. So that leather armor was like 50 gold. And we wanted to come back for it anyway. I see you, Minotaur. Oh, music's about to end. Shop prices are lower! Okay! Now we know for sure. I'm not gonna make it out of this dungeon. Music's about to end. Can I at least kill this guy and get his money? Yeah. Okay, so that ends your coin multiplier, I think. Oh, what hurt me? Oh. Alright, so this is the first time... What the hell? It's a mole. I don't think that hurt me. Still don't know for sure. I'm gonna attack the wall mimic with the broadsword. Ah! Oh, interesting. I can deflect the armadillo. I can take just a little bit of time to think. Oh, <laughs> I should have taken some time there because I can I can uh, hit the button a little late. Oh, hey, I had two apples. When did I get those? I didn't realize I had two apples. I should have used them. Seriously, when did I get those? <laughs> All right, let's try again. Uh, I guess we gotta spend some diamonds first. I have four. I kinda want that chest. Is there anything here that I want more than the chest? No. Hello. Back to zone two. I see you, Red Dragon. I know how to handle you now. There's a little too much else around, though, so I don't want to do it here. All right, pay attention for the wind spell, if he uses it. Oh, ow! Ah, uh, ah. Uh. I did that very poorly. There's just too many things here. I need to get... Hmm. Guess we're gonna fight the dragon. Ah! Oh, yeah, I knew I wasn't going to get out of that situation. That was terrible. Quicker start. Ooh, big mushroom. There's a black chest. Hey, broadsword. Uh. Ow. Okay, they'll get you from a long way away. Good to know. Man, I'm dying so quick. All right, let me force you against that. There we go. Well, I still can't get you. Dang it. All right, like this. I oh, almost could. Hmm. Just 
can't get a good angle on you, huh? Oh, there we go. Oh, except the golem got me. Ow. Ow. Still don't know what the holster does. I noticed the pack does, in fact, let me carry multiple items. I thought it didn't before, I don't know why I thought that. Just because of the way it displayed, I guess. Alright, this bat mini boss seems so easy to compare to the dragons. It doesn't doesn't really seem like a threat at all. I'm assuming it does like a lot of damage or something if I let it hit me. But it's not hard not to let it hit me. Those are just so much easier than... Oh, I shouldn't have stepped there then. <laughs> Alright, let's do better. Oh yeah, spend diamonds. Alright, let's just buy this chicken leg. Drumstick. Pretty soon I won't be able to spend as few diamonds as I'm getting here. Okay, there's still a one there. I don't know what that big heart thing is. Alright, don't step in the wrong time. Good. I feel like I should probably just leave wall mimics alone entirely. They're pretty dangerous. Ha! Ah! Okay, that didn't damage me. Now we know for sure. Has a potential to give me a lot of ow trouble though. Gotcha. No, 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 no. Uh, ah, ah. That did not go well. Wasn't sure how attacking from that works. Okay, don't attack that thing, it'll explode. Is it after a turn or is it immediately? Ah. Uh, that's not what I want. Can't afford any of that. Right, if I get some health back, I could buy that cheese and see if I'd end up with more health than... Oops. Apple, use it! Need more health to buy the cheese, though. I seem to remember the cheese healing more than an apple, but I don't know if it's more than two. Whoa, you're a scary new thing. What are you? Oh, you're easy. Like a green dragon, pretty much. Ha! Oh, armadillo. <laughs> I'm having some real trouble here. Alright, spend some more diamonds. Still don't have quite enough for this thing. So I could buy the ring and the scroll. Can't buy that for quite a while yet. Hello. Could buy the obsidian armor, pickaxe, or... That's not a broadsword, that's some sort of other sword. Alright, well let's spend them exactly since we have the opportunity to do so. I ran into a scroll of some color or another and it teleported me to the next level. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay. So wall mimics go down in one hit, even with the weakest dagger. Shop there. Oh, hello. Oh, that was not good. Oh, what? What? What on earth? Okay, so I guess that's a banshee or something. Yeah, blue banshee. Interesting. Can I afford anything? Nothing there. I have two. Yay, hey. yeah, okay. I'm gonna have to memorize some scroll colors, I think. Because I've already forgotten the one that I already used. Oh, hey! Oh, such a long range! No, don't stand there! <laughs> got to think so quick of this stuff. I really 
really like this rhythm mechanic, just because it's... It's a turn-based game, but also sort of action-y. I don't know, it's just an interesting hybrid. Because it's turn-based, but... Oops, get a limited amount of time to think. Ow. And I'm just a fan of rhythm games in general. They're a lot of fun. Yeah, you charge. Oops. Somehow my health is not in terrible shape yet. I feel like I've taken more damage than- Oh! He pulled me into the poison. Alright, so our exit is unlocked. Gotcha. Okay, so if I knock him from the side into a wall, that'll be on his back and I can attack him easily. Okay, looking good. Spear, yes. Pack, yes. Holster, don't know what it does, but I guess I have it now. Can I carry two weapons? I can! Oh, cool! That's what the holster's for. So ideally I'd replace that dagger with something that complements the spear, like maybe a broadsword or a flail or something. I'm a gun this way. I see you, Wall Mimic. Couldn't get the first strike there. Had to bomb to get into this shop, huh? Ooh. A bow? Crazy looking bow. Oh boy, dragon. Let's see if we can kill this guy before we deal with the dragon. Here we go. Don't care about the skeleton. Yes! something in there. Oh! Oh, those are like monkeys, but they hurt you. Okay. All right, well, this is why we're here. We gotta learn by dying a lot. Hello. Wish I could get here with five diamonds. I want to buy that big heart thing. Alright, obsidian armor it is. I do want to know what that is. I'll buy it next time. Ring of courage. No idea. Alright, I see you there in the sludge. Can I lure you out? There we go, that's how you do it. Whoa! Whoa! Huh. Okay. So that's exactly the same as water, it just doesn't go away after you. Alright, let's try this. Alright, cool. Well, we got it. Don't know what it does. Okay, that's how you fight the wall mimic. Oh, oh! It let me move after I killed a thing, I think. I would like... Don't know what the black scroll does. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'd like to try it. Let's try it now. Fear? Ooh, things are running away from me, I guess. Whoa. Okay, now we know. Ooh. Ring of Courage changes the... Uh, oh, wow! Changes the dynamic a lot. Ow! Not sure I'd like it entirely. Don't need that yet. I'll wait a little bit. Yeah, 
I think... I think I preferred it without the ring. Holster, cool. I'd like a better weapon to put into it. Alright, so there's the boss. Ah, there's one. Oh, the shopkeeper moved! Oh, that's funny. Come here. Piece of cake. Ow. Wait, does Courage let me move two in one? Ow. Right. Wasn't sure how to deal with that armadillo. Hang on, I'm gonna try something. Yeah, that lets me move two and one if I'm using a spear. Neat. Let's use our apple. Okay, apples are indeed one heart. Ooh. I'd like the Ring of Courage if I could control it, like if I could turn it off when I want it off. Seems like quite a ow trade-off. Oh, dead. <laughs> that red dragon would have killed me anyway. Alright, so we got to zone two, level two. Let's give this one more try, then I'm gonna do another hardcore run and see if I do any better at it. Somehow I managed not to get any diamonds that time. Surprising. Forgetting how to fight the skeletons from the front. Because I usually do it from the side. But not every time. Right. Did it right that time. Oh, right. Blue chests need keys. Keep forgetting what color is what. Ah, Banshee! Is there a weight key? Maybe there is. Oh, oops, that was dumb. Because, like, sometimes it's advantageous to wait. I don't want to have to move every single turn to keep up my coin multiplier. I don't know. Hmm. And there I am, following the rhythm of the menu again. Just happens naturally. Alright, one more hardcore mode try. or the compass. I'll come back to the armor. That sounds good. I've had the Ring of Regeneration before and it didn't seem to do anything. I don't know how it, uh, when it triggers, maybe at the end of the level or something? But I'm just gonna try not to take any damage, as much as I'd like to know how regeneration works. Alright, after the craziness of Zone 2, this one seems a lot easier. That looks like the sort of place the secret would be hiding, but there's nothing. Oops. Aw, oh, monkey! Aw, oh, stupid monkey! Okay, so you're vulnerable when there's a monkey on your back. Alright, well maybe we'll figure out the Ring of Regeneration. No, nope, can't use it. I keep bombing that out in the chance it's something else, but it's, it seems like it's always that health thing. 
Hmm. Alright, I'm just gonna come back to the armor. Let's do that. Might as well get the compass too, I guess. I do wish there were a way I could speed up sections like this where there's nothing happening. I just want to get from point A to point B. And it takes a long time. Ah, yeah, 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 my health regenerated. Cool! I like the ring. None of these rooms full of traps ever have anything good in them. Never seen anything good in one. I see that shop entrance over there. Not worried about it yet. Just have a simple dagger. I'd like something better. Ow. I don't know what to do other than just intentionally wait there. Can I bait the monkey into moving somehow? He's a cake. Hmm. Right, it is one hit. Whoa. How's this different from a regular whip? Whoa! Oh, I move when I use it. What's this? Whoa! That doesn't seem like a good thing. Can't even see these. Alright, that's a scroll, that's a chest, that's a flail. Let's buy the chest. Don't know what that is. A backpack, cool. That was worthwhile. By the way, I didn't mention it before, but the... Oh no, I'm still dark. Crap! The uh, the composer for this game is Danny Baranowski, who also did the music for Super Meat Boy and The Binding of Isaac. He's really good. I hate the Shrine of Darkness. This is the worst thing. Thank goodness. <laughs> I'm actually happy to die there because that was terrible. I'm gonna do one more. <laughs> I can't resist. I just want to play this game more. It's so good. For pre-ordering this game, I got a portion of the soundtrack. Uh, it had Zone 1 levels 1, 2, and 4. Zone 1 doesn't have a level 4 that I saw in the boss arena, and that did not have the music that was included for that track. I don't know why it didn't have the level 3 music. Maybe it wasn't, uh, wasn't complete at the time that I got that. So I don't know if the Zone 1 level 4 music that I got is in use somewhere else or what. Oops, you move every turn. I got that. This game is still under very active development right now. Pretty much every time I start it... Oh, no. Pretty much every time I start it, I get a change log with something new in it. Whoa! Ice Dragon's scary. I'm frozen. Okay, I got out. Kill a dragon. Run. Run. Oh, yeah! I feel good about myself. Now, can I survive this thing? Should be able to, right? 
Come on. Make a move where I can hit you. Oh, yeah! Oh! Hey, a shiny bomb. Do I get all these things? I haven't seen the shiny bomb before. Let's get it. Bomb spell! Oh, okay. So that's probably a regenerating bomb, basically. Wait, 25. 25 what? 25 turns? I would expect that to count down, but it doesn't. Okay, that took a lot of my time, so I'm not sure I can finish the, uh, the level now. Oops. Zombies have the craziest, like, 80s hairdos. <laughs> okay, wait 15. I don't know if it's 15 seconds, 15 turns. Whoops! Okay, so that's a nastier Minotaur. 14. Let's see if that goes down while we're just waiting here. Doesn't seem to. Alright. Anyway, that was a lot of fun. Um, hey, that, the, that Minotaur has a harp between its horns. Weird. Oh, that makes sense. Right, of course. Because, yeah. <laughs> just noticed that now. Alright. Anyway, I... I have to stop here or I'll just be playing this all night. I'm probably going to keep on playing it after I stop recording, just because I, I want to. Um, but I'll I'll do stuff that's not too new. Like, I won't, I won't explore any deeper into Zone 2 or anything. I'll just practice my hardcore mode and see if I can get a little better at the game. Oh, this is so much fun. See you guys next time.